Welcome back to the channel. Well, I guess welcome to the channel because this is the first video on my new channel. So, uh, yeah, sorry for the low quality, low effort video to start off with. I know it's not off to a great start, but uh, I forgot the date and uh, I was gonna try to upload a video every day until Christmas Eve because I have this thing. It's the 12 Days of Fishmas by Mystery Tackle Box Cash Co. And uh, so this is a Walmart exclusive. And what I planned on doing is I'm gonna open this thing up. We're gonna take a look at what's inside, but we're not gonna open the whole thing at once, okay? We're gonna open one every day like you're supposed to because it's an advent calendar. So we're gonna crack into it, see what's in it. I know, I don't know if you guys can hear that. It sounds like there's some crankbaits in there, maybe. Maybe crankbait. Kind of sounds like, like jingle bells, like Christmas bells, like sleigh bells. I don't know, I'm usually pretty good at that. Can't figure out what's in there right now. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna crack into this thing and then I'm gonna open one every single day, like I said. And then maybe after Christmas, depending on what happens with the holidays and everything, what I'm doing and um, what the weather's like, we're gonna go ahead and maybe try to do a slam with this thing and do every single like catch a fish on every single thing that's in here. Now it's going to be probably close to impossible because it is the middle of winter and uh, it's been snowing, it's been raining, it's been terrible. So uh, we'll go ahead and uh, give it a shot, but uh, no promises. All right, what we're gonna go ahead and do here is we're gonna take cellophane off this bad boy and see what we got going on in here. If I don't cut my finger. There we go. Try not to make a bloody mess all over. That would be a good sign for the first video on this channel. Let's throw this plastic away. And the trash can in here. And we're gonna take it. And it looks just like a... Oh, weird. Okay. Oh, it's just lines in the box. Okay, so it's got like this here sleeve on it. I can get it out. How does this thing, oh, <laughs> I'm stupid. Hey, guess what? It does that. <laughs> oh no, that's not cool. It tells you what's in there. Aw, so it's not really a surprise. Oh, I guess the last one is a surprise. All right, so check it out. Here's what we got in here. Looks like, uh, what is that? Uh, oh my God, what is that? Uh, is it Koshi Bug? Or, I can't remember how they pronounce that thing. Uh, so we got that right there. Looks like uh, we got maybe some sort of like pre-rigged like, jig or something right here. And then it looks like we got another, like a swim jig here, like a pre-rigged net rig, I mean. And then it looks like we got some sort of like ribbon tail worm here. Uh, maybe a little spinner bait. Looks like we got some hooks. Um, possibly a tortilla. I don't know what that is. I have no idea what that is. Maybe a tortilla. I don't know. Maybe that's, that's a tortilla right there. And it looks like we got some trailers here, maybe for like a spinner bait or something. Looks like right here. What's that? Like a looks like maybe like a spoon or something like that. I'm not sure what that is. And then I'm assuming this is a koozie, maybe. Looks like. And there it is. There's the crankbait. Looks like a lipless crankbait. Probably uh, it's probably the Vegan Squad clutch, probably. And then we actually have an actual mystery right here. So let's get into it, I guess. So I wonder what I, this thing comes with. Open it up. Oh, neat. So, oh, there's little sayings on the inside of the box, like little, uh, kind of like fishing Christmas puns. So it's got this little plastic tray in it. It's got two Zakoshi bugs. I think that's what those are called. God, I wish I knew. So yeah, it's got two of them in there. I think that's the 10,000 fish Zakoshi bug. And uh, they're great for like trailers or you can like kind of hook it up like on a little finesse thing or maybe like uh, you can put like a, like a jig head on it or uh, you know, you can put like a weedless, like a, I like the Z-Man, the mushroom head jigs. Those are cool. So weedless ones, hook those on there. So yeah, it looks like you do a couple cool things. Uh, you can do a couple different cool things with these. And it's like in a little plastic tray, but you get two of them. So that's not bad. Um, this whole thing costs 30 bucks, the Walmart exclusive. But none of the Walmarts, Walmarts within a uh, hundred mile radius. Yeah, not a single one sells this thing. So what I had to do was order it online. So I guess it's not 
because they say that you can't order it online or anything because it's a Walmart exclusive, but you can order it online from Walmart. So, you know, 30 bucks gets shipped to your house. So, uh, it's another thing I'm wanting to see is, uh, is this thing worth the money at the end? I mean, it looks like this thing down here on the 11th day, that looks like a Guggen Squad clutch, like the profile and the way, like the gill plate is on that. I don't know how well you can see that. But yeah, that looks like that's a Guggen Squad clutch. So, <clears throat> you know, that's worth a few bucks. I am not sure. I'm very excited to get to day seven because I want to see what we got right here. I don't know. It looks like we maybe got a tortilla in there. I'm not sure. Because that's what it looks like to me. I don't know. I'm trying to get that a little closer. See that? that right there? That's what I'm talking about. Looks like there's a tortilla in there. I'm not sure. So I'm excited to check that out. I'm also excited to see what this like pre-rig like Ned thing is right here. I'm assuming they're looking at that one right there. That looks like maybe it's the Guggen Squad Thick Jig. I'm not sure. That's probably the new, or I guess not super new, uh, the Guggen Squad Hammer Hooks. I'm not sure what the rest of this could be. That's, there's ribbon tail worm in here. Cause you know, catch coal has, uh, they do like Guggen Squad, they do like 10,000 fish. Uh, they do, what is it, Biospawn. They do a bunch of different companies. So there could be stuff for potentially all their product lineup in here. So that'll be really nice to get into. It looks, uh, it looks like it's gonna be interesting. I'm very, very interested to see what the 12 day thing is. I'm not gonna open it, I promise. I will open it on camera so you know I didn't peek or anything like that because these have like these little perforated doors right here. So hopefully you can hear them rip on camera so you don't think I'm a liar or anything like that. So uh, yeah, it looks like this thing is gonna be uh, pretty neat. And it's, it doesn't look like it's just like, I mean, yeah, it's mostly fishing stuff, but you know, it looks like, you know, the tortilla right there. And then we got, I'm assuming that's a koozie and I wonder, okay, so, New theory. It looks like the things that are in red are the things that it is. So, koozie and perhaps a sand hat, maybe? I don't know, that's kind of a small thing right there. I don't know if they'd be able to uh, fit both of those in there. But uh, definitely, probably a koozie. And uh, I still still wanna know what that is. I'm most excited, <laughs> most excited to see what that is and what that is, because that's just a question mark. So, uh, I don't know. I can't tell, all I can hear, all I can hear is that crankbait in there. Oh, that's uh, that's all I can hear rattling. So I can't tell what's in there and my wife hates it. When I do that, I'll shake boxes. I'm pretty good at guessing what's inside of it. So, uh, you know, not trying to ruin the surprise either. So uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So we'll set that to the side for now. And then uh, I'm gonna open this up and we can, man, that's gonna drive me crazy. I can't think of what that thing is. I'm pretty sure it's called the Sukoshi bug. Uh, or Sukoshi bug. Oh my god, that's gonna drive me crazy. Hold on, we're gonna get on the iPad real quick and look. Okay, I was way wrong. Like, okay, that's not. Oh no, what is this? Oh man, it's not that one. It is 10,000 fish. I wanna say it starts with a Y now. Oh no, I feel stupid. It is the Yoda worm. Oh my god. Okay. So disregard that entire thing. What I said it was, it's the Yoda worm. I got the name wrong on it. Yeah, it's a Yoda worm. 10,000 fish Yoda worm. Two green pumpkin, 10,000 fish Yoda worms. Now, I don't know if these are, uh, I don't know if these are gonna be different colors in every box or if they're gonna be green pumpkin in every box or if I can open this thing. Hold on. Finally. We got it open. I don't know how to finger. Finally got it open. Okay. Open her up. There it is. So it's kind of like, it's got this little, I mean, look at, you can't, look at that thing. You just barely move. It's like shaking just for my heartbeat. Like that tail is crazy. It's like really fine on there. But that thing is all kinds of crazy action on that thing. Look at it. This is a, a, Pretty good soft plastic. I'm digging it. Yeah, this looks like it'd be an excellent trailer or something like that. Or like, you know, I mean, it's got a, it's got a split in it. I'm assuming, ah, uh, maybe it's a, no, that's not what I thought it is. It's not a full like open like wide split, but it looks like it's got something in it like that. 
I think still got a split so you can uh, so you can like Texas rig this thing or like you know just rig it weightless or whatever you want to do with it I mean soft plastics are pretty versatile you know you can do whatever the hell you want on so yeah that's pretty neat so that's object number one is the uh the Yoda one I feel oh I dropped it I feel like an absolute fool now but I don't want to go back and redo this whole video I got what am I thinking of that's gonna drive me crazy now Oops, got that away. okay so the Sakoshi bug is kind of like this thing, but it's got like these weird little legs that come off the back of it. So yeah, this is the Yoda worm. I, mean, I, I knew I was close. It looks it looks like the Sakoshi bug, but yeah, no, it's a Yoda worm. It's a 10,000 fish Yoda worm. So uh, yeah, we're gonna, uh, oh man. I mean, this wouldn't be a bad thing, I guess, for that time of year, if we just drag it like real slow, probably. Like, I'll honestly, I'll probably put like a, hmm. I mean, I don't, Texas rig's not super great this time of year. Uh, really, like here, you know, around where I live, uh, it gets a lot colder, a lot faster than everywhere else. So, uh, you know, just like uh, jigs, pretty much just uh, dragging a jig real slow. And uh, it's about the only thing that uh, really seems like tried and true this time of year. It's pretty cold around here. I mean, I was out today going through, uh, checking out some new fishing spots and everything. And there was already ice on the water in a lot of the places I was at. So, uh, maybe we'll have to try to do an ice fishing slam with this thing. I, I don't think the lakes are going to freeze over by the time. But, for the sake of this new channel, and for the sake of subscribers, we're not going to pee, I promise. And, uh, I'm not going to buy another one, just so I can open it, just so I can have another one, I swear. Like, I'm not going to do that. Like, we're going to experience this together, and it's going to be great, I promise. So, yeah. Uh, welcome to the new channel. We're going to be doing a bunch of fishing and uh, a little bit of extra outdoor stuff. And um, quality is going to be a lot better. Um, I just kind of had to do this one on the fly. Quality is going to be a lot better. Trust me. Like, uh, I'm going to set up the good cameras and everything like that. And the quality is going to be great. I just had to do this on my phone real fast. And I'm doing it on the front camera so I can see if I'm framed and everything like that. I think I am. Yeah, I look pretty framed, I think grid on the screen so yeah we're gonna be doing uh, a lot of new fishing stuff uh we're gonna be just looking for fishing spots uh maybe some like vlogging and things like that you know just driving you know maybe we'll chop it up a little bit on the way to the spot you know i got a uh, gopro rigs in my car and everything like that oh another cool thing is um i got a new rod and uh i'm not gonna spoil it or anything like that because uh the real life not come yet so got the new rod and then we're gonna do like first impressions of it and everything like that. And then maybe I'll catch up on it. Maybe we'll do like a, like a 30 day or maybe we'll do like a, like a 90 day thing on it later and check that out. Another cool thing is uh, I got a project in mind. So uh, where it involves PVC pipes, magnets, and cool doodles. You'll see, you'll see when we get to it. So that's gonna be pretty cool. Uh, you know, maybe do a couple things like that. Like a couple little like, I hate using the term, but hacks for different things, like, uh, you know, maybe do like, uh, like, uh, I don't know, something, I don't know, something, I hate the term hack, and I, I'm trying to really figure out how to describe how to make something yourself without calling a hack. Back in my day, we called it just DIY, but apparently it's called hack, now. so, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna call it a hack, though, because I'm not a hack. <laughs> stupid welcome to the new channel so uh yeah like subscribe comment and uh all sorts of fun things like that and uh we'll see you in the next one